8-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. General, what do you think about the FBI saying that there's a terror alert on Monday about a potential Fort Hood situation? The police are shoving people, shoving Alex, shoving the crowd. Here we go, folks. I'm being assaulted. Whether it's the radio show, the news websites, documentary films, or the nightly news, InfoWars is the tip of the spear. Is this another false flag stage attack to take our civil liberties and put more homeland security while sticking their hands down on the pants on the streets? It's up to us to set brush fires in the minds of men and women everywhere. And that's what PrisonPlanet.tv is designed to do. You watch the Assad regime is going to be blamed or accused of using chemical weapons against the so-called rebels. What we see now is a war against reality. It's a war against the truth. It's more vital than ever that supporters of freedom become members of PrisonPlanet.tv and share their membership with up to 11 friends and family. Visit InfoWarsNews.com today. Become a member, share your membership, and help take the InfoWar to the next level. The globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency. Super Male Vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals. Super Male Vitality by InfoWars Life is so powerful that I only take half the recommended dose. For a limited time, we are offering 15% off Super Male Vitality at InfoWarsLife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today to secure your Super Male Vitality. InfoWarsLife.com a chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average, the county says it sprays with the glyphosate at least once a week. Few filters cut out the glyphosate that is found in water supply worldwide. Remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, hydrofluorosilicic acid, sodium hexafluorosilicate. Fluoride, it is in tea, it's in coffee, it's in water, it's in bread, it's in toothpaste. It is our responsibility to protect our families. The establishment's not going to do it. It's time to take action. It's time to filter our water. Visit InfoWarsStore.com and use promo code WATER to get 10% off their entire family of incredible products. Or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. We now take you live to the Central Texas Command Center. In the heart. In the heart of the resistance. We're it, folks, the heart. Rallying patriots worldwide. You're listening to The Alex Jones Show. Stand up and be counted for what you are about to receive. We are the dealers. We'll give you everything you need. You know what I'm selling? I'm selling liberty and freedom. And speaking of your phone calls and everything. This this broadcast is possible. I started plugging, but we ran into the break. By the books, the videos, the incredible supplements, the water filters, all the great systems. The the dash cams, high def uh, dash cams, the lowest price anywhere, the best quality InfoWars brand. InfoWarsStore.com. And we have the woman's cut in small right up to extra large Molon Lambe gold foil t-shirts. Nobody's got a Second Amendment shirt this sexy. We have the men's version as well, but it's not gold foil. It's uh, like gray silver. But the point is, is that it is awesome. Infowarsstore.com, you can see McAdoo, Lady Leanne McAdoo wearing it. Uh, and this is a bestseller. I designed the shirt. 
and I'm very, very proud of it. I didn't Photoshop, but I had the concept. The point is, it's an Alex Jones design. The shirt is made in America, printed in America, everything. It's American apparel. So, it's a great way to spread the word of the Second Amendment. It says Infowars.com on the back, Mullen Lobby on the front, and there's another version of the same shirt, but Infowars on the front, come and take it on the back. Infowarsstore.com or call toll-free, 888 Two five three three one three nine. Twenty four hours a day, seven days a week. Our great crew is ready to take your call and take your order. We don't send the tax man to take your money, give it to NPR, MSNBC, or all these groups. We just sell high quality products and say, "Hey, free association, buy the products." If you want to see the operation continue and expand, and you've responded, we appreciate all of your support with your PrisonPlanet.tv memberships. Uh, and the InfoWarsLife.com, all of it. Thank you so much for myself and the crew. It's, it's an honor to be here on the front lines uh, fighting the tyrants. All right, let's hurry to your calls. Donna in New Mexico, thank you for calling. Your take on the Ukraine situation, what Sky Television's calling, what could be the beginning of World War III. Hi, Alex. Uh, thanks for taking my call, and I want to say thanks to all of you there at InfoWars for doing such a great oh, job thank covering you. this. I think it's, it's hitting critical mass. I'm hoping that you're right with regard to the idea that this might just simply be a partition, but my gut and my radar, my internal radar says to me this is a little more than that and that we're, we're at a very dangerous crossroads here. But one of the points I wanted to make is about, I, I watch RT, I listen to you, um, and I also get Chinese state-run media. And I am surprised at China's tone with regard to Russia. They have all these big deals in the works. But when I watch Chinese state-run media, they are absolutely very much against Russia. In yeah, no, no, I've, exactly. I've studied this in depth from every angle, interview. Well, you've heard them, just literally hundreds of top experts, former State Department people, CIA, you name it. China has sold out to the same globalists that run us. Now, they may double-cross them, but... That's why all our jobs go there. We can't have power plants. They can. They exploit their people. They have, you know, mobile execution vans, suicide nets. China is hell on earth for their people. They're being used by the globalists because they're hardworking, smart people to leverage out all competition worldwide, deindustrialize the rest of the world, transfer all power to a select group of inside corporations that are playing countries off. And yes. China acts like they're with Russia on bricks. China is basically double-crossing Russia. And, and Russia is all on its own backing Syria and Iran. And again, I'm not romanticizing Iran. Terrible government. The point is it's Russia, China, and Syria. Excuse me, Russia, um, Russia, Iran, and uh, Syria. And then you've got the global bankers using China to buy off our politicians, control our media, and deindustrialize us. So it's the globalist with China against America and Russia, and now they want to play us off against each other in this final epic economic but also military skirmish. What do you think of that analysis? Well, I think it's very dangerous, and but, but it, I didn't really realize until recently how dangerous it actually is. And I have to say that I live on a mountaintop in northern New Mexico, and I was driving down the mountain yesterday to do some errands. And for the first time, I actually was scared, and I thought, my God, what if it happened right now that there was a nuclear attack, and I couldn't get home to my family? And I, I was actually scared. And I haven't felt that way. I mean, I was a kid in the, the, the Cuban Missile Crisis. And now I'm going, this could happen at any moment. And I'm That's I'm right. And the Russians will not threaten to nuke us unless they're ready to do it. And, and if anybody attacks Russian forces in a big way and they get a defeat, they're going to launch missiles at NATO bases. And then they know there's going to be a full response. So Russia's just going to have a full nuclear attack. Uh, the cruise missiles off our coast launched from ships and submarines. It is, it, uh, I'm not saying it could happen. I hope it does it, but it, it, it's a possibility, and it's sheer madness. And look at our leadership. They are the scum of the earth. That's the problem. God bless you. Great call. Thanks for holding Donna. Yeah, it's, it's just unbelievable. I've studied it, folks. It's the EU bankers with the globalist bankers with the Chinese government, the communist. It was the bankers in 1917 put... Lenin into power. U U.S. and British bankers put Lenin into power. Look that up. They give Stalin $25 million in gold to do it and shipped about 100,000 American troops over there, uh, Russian first and second generation immigrants off the East Coast to take over. That was the Bolsheviks.
it took them six, seven years just to secure the whole country. They mainly only had Moscow. And then you realize, oh my gosh, the Trotskyites and all the rest of them over here, the neocons, they want to do that here. The Trotskyites are the Democratic Party's Republican arm. And they literally are the sons and grandsons of Trotsky, of the Trotskyites. I mean, you see, the average American has no idea how much trouble we're in. Communism came from here, came from England, just like Nazism came from England. And I'm not demonizing ain't British. I mean, my name's Jones. I'm Welsh. But the whole point is, is they use the power of that empire to build this world corporate government. And they're playing countries off against each other. Look, the globalists want my guns, I'm against it. They want open borders, I'm against it. They want to break up families, I'm against it. They want to attack Russia, I'm against it. They want to attack Syria with Al-Qaeda, I'm against it. Whatever they're for, I'm against it. Then I can intellectually look at why I'm against it. But you can bet, if CNN and MSNBC are pushing something, you shouldn't be for it. Stuart in Canada, you're on the air, thanks for holding. Alex, an absolute pleasure and honor to be on your program. Honor to talk to you, brother. You know well, thanks. Uh, I'm here in Canada. Uh, my battery's low, and I hope I don't lose it. It's okay. Go ahead. Make a point. But, okay, good. About the Ukraine, you know, I do my own research always. And so I YouTube this, and I look at these apparent peaceful protesters taking over their democratically elected government. And I'm looking at this, and I'm thinking, well, they got pistols, they got steel pipes, they got Molotov cocktails, and they're absolutely brutal savage, vicious human beings. These aren't peaceful protests. And when your pre president, Barack Obama, calls them peaceful protesters, i got to say to Barack Obama, is that what you want on your front doorstep? Molotov well, I was about to say, <laughs> Ukraine's elected government votes to not join the EU. They activate 100,000-plus State Department-funded thugs to shoot police, blow up buildings, and firebomb people, and they're called peaceful heroes. Now the Russian areas that are Russian ethnic are under military attack and they're supposed to lay down and die and our media is calling them terrorists. It's just not true. I mean, if you call the Russian government corrupt, kleptocratic, authoritarian, that's true. But they didn't start this. That's the point. The West walked well, right up and punched Russia right in the nose and then is saying Russia is starting something. And that's the thing, when we recognize this as individuals and we see this ourselves, we have a computer, we can do the research ourselves, we don't have to go to CNN, ABC, Alex Jones, we don't have to go anywhere. We can see this stuff for, with, in front of our very eyes. And you can make your own position on that. You do not want that in your country. i got to make this point, too. I call into Fox News. The, uh, I haven't gone into Rush Limbaugh, but I get into all sorts of alternative media, or not alternative, mainstream media, and I set the agenda. I set the dialogue. That's right. And People should be calling I'm into shows, all of them, C-SPAN, you name it, and getting the word out. We're going to continue with calls. These calls are too important today. I'll, I'll hit some of the other news as well in the next segment, Infowars.com. From the water table, to our soils, to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. And most Americans spend 90% of their time inside using toxic chemicals within their homes. There are more than 42 million smokers in the United States. Well over a thousand types of mold and mildew linked to numerous conditions. And don't forget the fact that six million Americans live with pets they're allergic to as well. When I began to research these statistics, it was clear to me it was time to start cleansing my lungs in order to combat the toxic environment that we cannot escape but that we can fight back against. Made with organic and wild cultivated herbs and manufactured in the USA, the new InfoWars Life Lung Cleanse is here in a convenient spray bottle that can be brought with you throughout any toxic environment. Now available exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. In the last 50 years, iodine has been phased out of our staple foods and replaced with the halogen bromine, a practice now banned in nations around the world. Guess what else is in the halogen family? Fluoride. Ladies and gentlemen, Alex Jones here. In 1924, the federal government did the right thing and encouraged salt producers to add iodine. It's the good halogen on the periodic table. And the results are on record, reports documented, a 15-point IQ increase in areas that had previously been deficient in iodine. 
bottom line iodine is important. Unbound, clean, in a glycerin base. Nascent iodine was the answer for myself and my family. You will find Survival Shield Nascent Iodine exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWars Life Survival Shield Nascent